Sanofi is developing a vaccine to protect against COVID-19 disease. It uses the same technology developed to produce one of our seasonal influenza vaccines. The candidate vaccine is designed to raise an immune response that will help the body fight off the SARS-CoV-2 virus. It targets a protein on the surface of the virus called the spike. The spike protein helps the virus gain entry into a person's cells, including those in the lungs. Once inside the cell, the virus replicates. It can then enter many other cells in the body. In response to the infection, the body's immune system produces antibodies against the SARS-CoV-2 virus, which stops the virus from multiplying. A vaccine that targets the spike protein can help the body build this defense by simulating an infection without making the person sick. In the lab, scientists copy the spike protein's DNA sequence then insert it into a circular piece of DNA called a plasmid. This is called recombinant DNA because it recombines different segments of DNA. The plasmid transports the spike DNA sequence into a baculovirus, a delivery system that is used to help manufacture the vaccine. Meanwhile, specialized cells in the lab are on standby, ready to act as miniature factories. The baculovirus enters these cells and starts replicating, producing many identical copies of the spike protein in the process. The scientists can then extract spike proteins from the mixture, purify them, collect them in large batches, and formulate them before dispensing them into vials. This candidate vaccine is designed to be used in combination with an adjuvant, a component of the vaccine that helps the immune system mount a defense and produce antibodies directed against the spike protein. Sanofi's recombinant protein vaccine candidate is currently in clinical development and its safety and efficacy have not been evaluated by any regulatory authority.